Assalamu alaikum guys this is Ata you are watching Kiama Explorer love your life and uh, just wanted to go through the week how did you go with your week to all those youngsters who are fasting for the first time or maybe fasting a couple of years or three time whatever it is uh, how do you feel like what uh, what did you guys do like did you really fast or you know you started your fasting but because of your health maybe you know first time it's a bit tough on you uh, there are a lot of reasons not to do fasting one of the major reason is if you are sick and if your body doesn't support you <coughs> uh, maybe one of the reasons might be that uh, because uh, especially when you get older uh, and you know your body gives up on you especially when your doctor says you know if you fast you know you you need to take medicines or time just an example you know for all those elderly people so hopefully you have done your best of your best hopefully you have uh, prayed on time yep this is very important to uh, praying is a part of it and in Ramzan uh, especially if you are fasting you must pray on time no delays no no saying like you know i will pray later and things like that it's, uh, now now that you have grown up uh, you should know your limits you should know what to do what what you should not do uh, as i'm pretty sure you must be very young maybe with your first or second year of your fasting you should know that you should not lie to your parents in fact no one i don't know what is this stupid thing about you know talking on uh, lying that you should you know lie to protect someone what lie to protect someone what sort of lie is that you know because of this stupidity uh, you know the the home uh, get div divided into pieces this is what happened in my family. I will tell you the truth. In my family, do you know, my mom, she started protecting me so much. You protecting, uh, protecting our own husband, my, my mom. And you know what she did? In order to join the children with the, the, with the father, she started small, small lies. And she felt like with this, you know, the family can live a very happy life. Seriously, that is what happened. Nothing has happened, guys. Everything is gone. Everything has been screwed up because of that. So, small lies, big lies. It's a lie. Screw it up. If you do lie, go and tell that person I lied or whatever it is. Just make sure you don't lie. Simple as that. No matter if you uh, if it's if you get punishment, uh, if you go and tell you if you go and tell the truth, maybe the punishment might be might not be there you are still thinking you know that if i go to say the truth i might be in trouble see this is the point here so we need to make sure the this remaining three weeks uh, up and down whatever your uh, fasting days are approximately three weeks and some days to go so uh, just make sure you're doing your best you are doing uh, you are doing best of your ability and uh, wish you all the best for these upcoming weeks also uh, upcoming weeks we have some shahadat coming up uh, just make sure you fast on those days all the viladat of uh, uh, Mola imam hassan is coming up make sure you you should know you should know these days and i will be definitely talking every week so keep an eye on that thank you so much for your time i really appreciate your time and uh, see you next week bye